She's been quite upset about it and said she wants me to stop. She doesn't want to end our open relationship deal, but she doesn't want me sleeping with other people that we know. Welcome back to They Did What? Your source for the internet's craziest, most entertaining stories where I go over them, analyze them, and most certainly make fun of them. Today, I'm going to go over a story titled, My Wife, a 45-year-old female, demanded that we have an open relationship and now isn't happy that I'm sleeping with our daughter's 21-year-old friend. And guys, what we have here is yet another story of some bonehead husband who eventually caved because his wife wanted was bored, was tired of him, and wanted to go hook up with other dudes but still keep him around to take care of the bills and have her not be alone and all that. And uh, sadly, this, this guy goes along with it. However, things don't exactly go the way the demanding wife expected, as eventually this guy starts having his fun too, and in fact, starts nailing a 21-year-old who happens to be his daughter's friend. Now, we can go back and forth on whether that's awful in so many ways or not, but you're going to find out that it was his daughter who had this, put this idea in the mom's head to begin with. So I think it's quite appropriate here. But anyhow, guys, as all these stories go, things never end well when somebody proposes this idea of open marriage. And by the way, you're going to see here, like I said, that the daughter is the one that puts this idea in the mother's head. And I'm sure that the mother was no problem being receptive to this. It's amazing how this is becoming more the norm. And yet, people always think they're different. My situation is different. It'll work out just fine. It doesn't work out. The only time this thing works out is for people that both of them went into the relationship or marriage that were already uh, experiencing alternative lifestyles, if you will. But just to pull down nowhere after being married for 10 years, 15 years, 20 years, and think it's going to work, never going to work. And yet again, another wife demands it, another P-Whip husband that goes for it, and it blows up in her face. So it starts off, he says here, uh, sometime last year, my wife approached me about opening up our relationship. Our SEX life had deteriorated a lot over the years, and in the end, I just stopped pursuing it completely. If I was lucky, I'd get, you know what, maybe once a month or so, even then it came with a number of caveats to the point that it felt like a transaction. Well, newsflash, marriage is essentially a transaction. It is a business deal. And it's always a business deal where overwhelmingly the guy gets the raw deal. And yet more and more guys will do this every day. Uh, after months of I'm too tired or not now or I'm not in the mood, I just stopped asking and we went about eight months without any form of intimacy at all. There's his problem. Well, his, this guy has a lot of problems. Asking. You don't walk up to your girl and just ask for SEX. You lead things in the direction to the bedroom. That's what a man does. So, of course, she's turned off. And guarantee you, she, she's the jerk in this situation. We could all agree there. However, this guy, you can connect the dots real quick, hasn't been doing things to help himself too much, to be appealing enough, acting like a man enough to have her actually want to roll in the hay with him. Hence all the excuses and all that. Because guess what? Women want to get a sausage, okay? And you're going to see here, she does. But she's so turned off by her husband here, then, you know. It says here, he said, I would get a kiss on the cheek, and that would be the absolute limit. My wife worries about her age and the toll three kids have taken on her body. But I still find her as beautiful as the day I married her, and her body is more than enough to keep me going. Well, in a perfect world, that would be enough for her if she was in love with the guy, which she clearly is not. Not being able to show her how beautiful I find her as words haven't been enough and has been difficult. Because obviously she checked out of the relationship a long time ago. And then in comes the daughter's suggestion about the open marriage. She's like, hey, sounds like a good idea to me. Uh, before the mess of last year started, she uh, approached the subject of seeing other people. It wasn't something I wanted to do, and I was against it. But she explained that in order for her to get her confidence back, she wanted to be, to be desired by other people. Oh my God, and this dumb sucker actually bought into this. As I said before, the second she brings up the open marriage, it's over. But let's be honest, in this situation, it's been over a long time. He's been with her for a long time, obviously. There's no SEX, so this guy should walk away. Obviously, the kids are old enough. They're adults now, what I'm, I've gathered here. So what the hell is holding him back? 
Okay, sure, he gets hit in the divorce and all that, but he can start over. But this guy obviously isn't strong enough to either walk away or lay down the law and say, hey, I'm tired of living in a, in a marriage where essentially we're roommates here or taking some action. Nope. So she's taking action. Uh, goes on, he says here, I believe this was prompted by our eldest daughter, and she's very much into this new age stuff. Oh, because your daughter, who's 21, has so much experience in relationships and marriage and all that, that so the, she, the wife can listen to her because she, the daughter is all-knowing. The wife was looking any excuse. And what does this say about the daughter? What about this say about the daughter, her views towards her own father, when the, the daughters encourage her mom to go cheat on the father? but just label it different, repackage it as an open relationship so she can get permission. What does that say? This guy should walk away from these people. Uh, as I said, I wasn't happy, but I can see where there's no point in arguing as it'd be simpler for me to agree. Smack. This is why your wife doesn't want to sleep with you, because you're a pussy. He, no, no point in arguing because uh, it'd be simpler to agree. She has no respect for you. I don't have respect for you in this regard. Okay? It's so sad to see how guys allow themselves to be so pee with. They get so worn down that it's always like, yes, dear, whatever you say, dear. Do you think women are lined up to, to hook up with that dude? No way. They're disgusted by men like that. But there's a whole world full of guys that are that weak. So I try to help build guys up that they don't become like that. Uh, we didn't really set any ground rules, and my wife just took my acceptance at face value and carried on. Oh, I'm sure she carried on, because this guy didn't have the balls to say no, let alone set any ground rules for this this ridiculous situation. Uh, I don't know whether she acted on it, as I've been rather busy with work in the last year, but I do know that she did spend two nights away from the house. As I wasn't really interested in this, in the first place, I didn't pursue anyone. In my eyes, I just wanted to, my wife to realize how beautiful she was so that our SEX life would return. You actually think it's going to return? What will probably happen is she's probably hoping to find somebody else. That's what's going to happen. She'll go hook up with some dudes, make herself feel beautiful, because if she's, if she's above average for her age in her late 40s, let's just say she is, there are guys that want to sleep with her. Okay, she can hold a sign saying free pee, and there'll be a line down the road if she's above average for her age. And I, I want to emphasize for her age. And the second you might find a guy that she actually acts like a man and she can respect, boom, she's out of there. That's what's going to happen. Uh, my daughter has a close friend who is frequently coming around, and they've been close friends for quite a few years. So much so that we occasionally chat, and she's around the house, and it's not that much of a surprise if she's around the house. We've become closer over the past year as she's been spending more and more time around our house, and it's, it's uh, through her that I learned that the open relationship was my daughter's idea. Disowned. Talk about a betrayal, huh? Well, that's okay. Because, well, if it's the daughter's idea to have an open relationship, and it was the daughter who put this crap in my wife's head, well, you know what? I, there's something I can do. To stop rambling ahead, one thing led to another, and I have been sleeping with her quite regularly. Wow, dude. Now, we can go back and forth on this, because he's known her for a long time, before she was legal. I, I would be high-fiving this guy completely if this was just some other 21-year-old because it would piss off the daughter and the wife. But her friend, there's a part of me that's thinking good for you. The other part of me that's like, eh, I would choose another 21-year-old. But I think the daughter has this coming, and I think the, the wife has this coming. At first, we were just using hotels to keep it out of the house. But the whole 2020 issue made us use the house, and my daughter has caught us a few times. That must have been awkward. She made it clear that she saw no issue with it, and whilst my wife has never seen us together, she is aware. Your daughter has no problem with this. Who is this family? Really? Uh, my wife, she's quite upset about it and says she wants me to stop. She doesn't want to end our open relationship deal, but she doesn't want me to be sleeping with other people we know. More like she doesn't want you sleeping with a girl that's more than half her age. And of course she doesn't want to stop. She's looking for your replacement, dude. I'm at a crossroads here. I'm quite enjoying this uh, purely physical relationship, and I don't want to go back to merely looking forward to a kiss that isn't on my cheek. But at some point, I don't want to c cause my wife any grief. Again, with the, with the pee whipped, I don't want to cause my wife any grief. Dude, it's you trying to appease her and please her and put her on the pedestal as, as she treats you this way in the first place. For a second, you were actually having some balls and finally getting some with the younger chick. But seriously, man. Now, I would recommend you stop with the 
girl, the girl, your daughter's friend you've known for a long time, and maybe find some other younger girls. But he needs to walk away. He needs to grow a pair and walk away because his daughter's an a-hole, his wife's an a-hole. But I don't think this guy has the strength in him. This guy needs a good smack in the face, slap upside the head, and get some serious coaching to get his freaking balls back because he's lost his balls a long time ago. But this is a bad marriage. He needs to end it. Even if it hurts for a while, he can get past it. Now, I'm going to read a few comments here because they're pretty uh, mixed and they're entertaining because there are people that are disgusted with this guy and other people that see it as pretty cool. And uh, one guy says, uh, your wife didn't want an open relationship. She wanted a pass to sleep around and you've been there waiting for her when she's done. She clearly didn't think you'd be able to find a partner as quickly as you have and now she's regretful. Exactly. He says, you, you got, she got exactly what she asked for. She has no right to be upset. Exactly. Now, it is the daughter's friend. I can see some issue there. But other than that, no way. Uh, another person says, This whole situation is shit. But you're an effing pig for effing your daughter's 21-year-old friend. You knew this woman growing up. What the eff is wrong with you? Well, it sounds like the daughter's friend was probably putting the moves on him first. you know. And the daughter doesn't seem to have a problem with it, which shows this whole family screwed up. Uh, another guy says... Uh, what he did was the best RP act I've ever seen, and it's clean slap to both the daughter for suggesting this and the wife for being a thought. Yeah. Another one says, I don't even know where to begin with this. Should have established some boundaries. She can't have it both ways. Regardless of her being okay with it, dude, seriously, a girl who's young enough to be your daughter and her friend, no doubt, that is a mess. Well, I have no problem with him. If she's 21 years old, fine, whatever, because probably the wife is hooking up with dudes much younger too. I'm willing to bet you. But uh, daughter's friend, again, I got some issue because he's known her growing up. You know, that, that could be a little weird, but that's just me. And another one says, I heavily suggest ending the marriage the moment the idea of open relationship entered her mind. Ding, ding, ding. On the matter of your sex life, I have no issues with it. The age gap would just be an issue if you consider a relationship, but if it's just sex, then have it. Uh, you're both adults. Considering how every day the sugar baby lifestyle is and how many women sell their bodies to older men, it is virtually wholesome to see that SEX is happening. And I don't think it is, a groom, is grooming because the younger women chasing older mature men is a natural part of our species. It wasn't until I hit my 30s that women 10 years younger than me became uh, away from my existence. Leave the wife and don't, get, don't ever get serious with the fling. At best, if she shows you that she's falling for you, end it. Yeah, it's just a fling. And get rid of the wife. And last one, this guy says, I don't even know where to begin. If I was your wife, I'd be effing furious. If, it w if, if I was your daughter, I'd be furious and creep the F out. What is wrong with everyone in this story except maybe the wife? And guess what? That was written by, wait for it, a woman. A woman viewer that was pissed off about that whole thing. So anyway, guys, screwed up situation. He got some payback. Definitely stuck it to the wife by nailing a 21-year-old and not to mention the daughter's friend, the daughter who brought this whole idea to begin with. But this whole family screwed up. Walk away ended. The daughter's trash. The wife is trash. The guy's a pussy. Okay, They're, they all need help. Seriously, on multiple fronts. But anyhow, it's always funny when uh, these things blow up in the face of the person suggesting this idea. These things don't work out. These people got to stop doing this. Anybody's watching this story, they stumbled upon it on YouTube or whatever, and you're thinking of doing this, it's not going to work. Don't waste your time. Unless you're intentionally trying to sabotage your marriage. Then knock yourself out. I feel bad for the person that gets hurt, but it ain't going to work out. So, all right, guys, that is it for today. Be sure to comment down below. Let me know what you think about this. And, guys, you come across a really good story you'd like me to share on this channel, something uh, something crazy, something outrageous, something related to what I talk about, whether it's an article, a story, something in your own personal life that you've experienced that would be qualified for this, email it to me, strongsuccessfulmail at gmail.com. Just make sure if it's your own story, Make sure you write it out well. Make it easy for me to read. If it's an article, include the article link or the uh, Reddit link so I can, that way I can find it pretty easily. And be sure to like the video, share with your friends, and subscribe. And I'll catch you next time.